Or we are in for a treat tonight. The cocky young cruiserweight, former ECW star, who has had unmatched success in WCW. The following contest is a triple threat extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring from El Paso, Texas. Weighing in at 205 pounds, Eddie Guerrero. The former WCW Cruiserweight and United Alex States Alex Champion, Alex. a man who has held the ECW television title. And above all, Go Eddie him. Guerrero doesn't care if he's liked. He's not sure if he ever will care. Eddie Guerrero always sporting that cocky look on his face, but to Guerrero's credit, he always backs it up inside the ring. He may be a cruiserweight, but he can take on anyone. And here comes one of my favorites. And his opponents, first, from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 187 pounds, Chris Jerry O. Oh. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. A competitor who always has his game face on, ready for a major battle. and they'd still walk into the ring with a smile. That's you know it. what? I'd still bet on them. They've got such incredible heart. They never give up on themselves. Well, if you're going to be dumb, you got to be tough. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. dreams in this match. There he goes, right into the corner. Ooh. In a matchup like this, Corey, what is something the competitors need to remember? Well, a major difference in a triple threat is that you can lose a match without being part of the decision. Incoming! Evades the attack! Right forearm. Oh my God! Poison runner. Beautiful athleticism. Spinning kick to the gut. 
This crowd is truly unworthy of his incredible magnificence. Oh, arm drag. He's looking a little off balance. Chest. Big kick right to the gut. Taking it outside the ring now. What's he going to find out there? He's got a kendo stick. A weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. Off into the pin. The pin's broken up. I can't believe it. And just like that, he said crashing to the floor. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Springboard! Are you kidding me? That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. This match grinded him down a little. Face first, here it comes. And a reversal by Guerrero. Whoa! 
give up. He's taking this to the floor now. It's like I always say, he who has the sledgehammer has the last lap. Oh, right in there. Quick strike to the lower body. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Oh, I had that well scouted. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. And in the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Oh, disturbing impact. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. I will scramble your insides. He just looks helpless to every attack. Yeah, he has really hit a brick wall here. And he was ready for that. Close line. From behind. And he gets countered.
here is your winner, Ray. Impressively withstanding the onslaught of the two other superstars to stand tall and have their arm raised here and now. To win a triple threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner showed all three in victory.